uh, we are looking to replace this entire trunk line right here. Uh, right now it's an 8x14, uh, which is uh, about half the CFM we need. It's on a three ton system. Uh, the supply runs, um, there's a lot of issues with these. These are all basically, they're, they're not attached. They're just kind of sitting in the hole on the top of the unit. So these will basically just pull straight out of here. Uh, but there are seven in total. Got one, two, three. Oh, hang on a second. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there's seven that are coming out the top. And then there's one that's coming out the side here. Um, so what we're going to do, it's going to be a little tight. So her laundry is sitting over here just underneath of this. So I don't want to make this much more than eight inches because uh, it'll just cut into the space that we need. But over here, there's enough room. We could get the CFM if we did a 10 by 20, which there's plenty of, plenty of room here to get 20 inches. The problem is that the return, which is right here, I mean, I think it's gonna butt right up against it. So as long as we squeeze this over to the far edge, I think we can get a 10 by 20 in here and it'll just be like right up against this return. I don't wanna do a 16 by 12 because then that would just be like right in your face as you're trying to do laundry here. Yeah, I mean, that would hang way down. So it's a total length of uh, 14 and a half feet from right here all the way down. Um, and the one other thing that we'll need to do is we'll need to add an eight inch supply, which I'm thinking that this one right here, so they're all six inch. This one right here doesn't have any asbestos. Somebody's already pulled it off. So I'm thinking we'll probably, probably take this one here make that an eight inch supply. Uh, speaking of asbestos, there's a couple spots on here you'll have to be aware of. So this is all obviously coming down. Um, there is asbestos tape on the end of this to be aware of if we want to like paint over it or wet it down. Um, otherwise that should come right off. You really shouldn't have to mess with the tape. It'll probably pull right apart. And then the other spot is right here. So this supply has got a little bit of tape wrapped around it as well. So we'll need to wet that down. And then there is one of the supplies, I believe it's this one here. Yeah, this one, it's pulled apart. Try to get it here. if there's much we can do about that or not but I'd like to try and get that sealed and then lastly we're going to be replacing this return box uh, 54 inches from right here to the floor we'll do uh, probably a 10 by 26 and we'll just scoot it over Far enough to get the April air box in there. Right now it's 20, or excuse me, it's six inches. So we'll do a 10 by 26. Get the April air five inch media cabinet in there. All right, and it is a walkout.